National Engineering College is located at the industrial town of Kovilpatti, known for its matches and textile industry. Major business establishments like port, copper smelter, fertilizer plant, power plants, cement plants and a world-renowned firecracker hub are located within the radius of 60 kilometers from the college. The college sits on National Highway NH7 and on the main Chennai Trivandrum rail line with numerous overnight connections to Chennai, Bangalore, Trivandrum and Coimbatore. The Madurai International Airport and Tutikorin Airport are 90 minute drive from the institute. The catchment districts of the college have always had high standards of school education. The chairman, Duruke Ramasamy, felt that the community deserved high quality higher education to feed the industrialization of the region and the seeds for a great institute were thus sown in 1984. From a humble beginning with three branches and 180 students, the college has grown manifolds in the last three decades. Today, around 3,000 students participate in seven undergraduate and 10 postgraduate programs. The college has earned a lot of laurels in this eventful journey, including the NBA, NAC accreditation and UGC and being declared an autonomous institution in 2011. 65% of the students are admitted through single window counseling system of Anna University Chennai and the rest through the self-financing college's entrance test. It is common for the loss in small ranges. Raven, you carry on. Of course. The biggest asset of an institute is Hello, sir. Hello. The faculty. At our college, the student-faculty ratio is healthy 13 to 1. Moreover, 60% of the faculty has spent more than 10 years with the institute. Today, 15% of NEC's faculty have a PhD and the number will swell to 40% in a couple of years' time. There has been emphasis on continuous skill and knowledge, upgradation of the faculty. They have received various accolades and have made 425 publications in international journals in the last decade and authored 11 books. There has been a significant shift towards the research and creation of intellectual capital in the past few years. NEC is a recognized research center under Anna University for all the seven departments. College is very keen in leveraging its expertise to improve productivity of the surrounding businesses and community. This has been possible by the numerous projects taken by the Institute's faculty and students with the businesses and government establishment. Around 4.5 crores worth of projects have been executed for various agencies like CSIR, DST, DAE, ICMR, DRDO, AICTE and others. We have signed MOU with various core companies, IT industries and supporting consultancy. In line with the vision of bringing world-class education to the semi-urban and rural community, our college has created one of the largest Wi-Fi campuses in Tamil Nadu. The college already boasts of 20 distinct computer labs across various departments focused on specific technologies and has around 1,500 systems. Notables amongst these are the Cisco Network Academy, IBM Center of Excellence, Advanced CAD CAM and Mobility Development. There are 40 advanced labs on various fields of engineering and basic sciences, including labs on high voltage systems, energy simulation, mechatronics, VLSI, non-destructive testing, liquid dielectricity, embedded systems, soil mechanics, and environmental engineering, which caters to the thirst for knowledge of the young minds at the institute. There are also smart classrooms to enhance 
the learning experience of the students. Over 49,000 square foot library has a rich collection of books, DVDs, ebooks, digital databases. The college has safe, homely, and well equipped hostels for both boys and girls. Around 2,000 students stay in hostels and the rest avail the fleet of buses to commute daily from home. College has kept constant pace with the changing needs of the students. I'm proud to say that myself and some of my classmates have done some long-term projects with some major organizations. Thanks to the flexibility offered by the outcome-based education and choice-based credit system, students of all years go on visits to various companies to acquaint themselves with the practices of the industry. To align the curriculum with the needs of the industry, certain final year electives have been designed and delivered by faculty from industry. The college actively conducts development and certification programs of leading software companies like Cisco, Infosys, and TCS. To add another feather to our cap, we have recently launched an incubation center wherein corporate and students work hand in hand on live industry projects. The hallmark of any educational institution is defined by the students. Our students are doing very well in academics. We have ranked number one in April 2014 examinations with an outstanding pass percentage of 96.95%. 2014 passed out batch has secured 42 university ranks. There has been a steady improvement in the number of students taking up higher education in the engineering as well as management domain. Academic excellence can only be achieved when a healthy mind sits in a healthy body. Our students have been participating in various zonal interzonal competitions and have bagged various prizes. There are a host of sports facilities including hockey, basketball, volleyball, tennis, cricket and football. The college has created a plethora of platforms for holistic development of students. Foremost amongst them are national bodies like NSS, NCC, technical clubs like IEEE, CSI and ISTE. Non-technical clubs like Rotaract, JCs to name a few. To fine-tune the English speaking skills, a language lab of highest quality features has been functioning having TOEFL, IELTS practice materials. Having a job before the end of the course is a dream for every student. Our placement cell has been very active in preparing the students for the assessment process of various corporates. Our students are performing very good in campus placement and we are working towards 100% placements. Today we are going to meet with Eric Commodore. Interviews can also be arranged through state-of-the-art video conferencing facilities on campus. We have alumni chapters in Chennai, Bangalore, Singapore, US, Europe, and Middle East. National Engineering College 2002 passed out. And 2002 Mechanical Engineer. I'm currently working as a Senior Solution Architect. I wish all the future NECNs a very bright future. And I support any. 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 I support NEC. I support NEC. I support NEC. I support NEC. Over 12,000 alumni are our biggest strength. We have with her the stiff competition and maintain our status as one of the preferred destinations for engineering education in southern Tamil Nadu, which is evident from the quality of academic performance of the incoming students year after year. The college will continue to put more emphasis on creating intellectual capital and unleashing the potential of students to provide outstanding engineers to the community and world at large. We at National Engineering College are one step above.